Hello everybody and welcome back to Gix's Adventures in Skyrim. Last time I was pretty much roaming around like an idiot, uh, but I did manage to get to uh, Windhelm, and um, there's not much I'm going to do here today, um, but here's my thought process of what I'm going to do. I actually plan stuff today. Um, I was listening to a conversation while roaming around town, and yeah, that's it. I already know, uh, which last time I thought they meant Latinos, which you know, was kind of weird. So, um, apparently this dude, or whoever it is, is doing something nasty. Actually, I really don't know what he's doing, but, you know, people are afraid, uh, like there's rumors going around town, at least... As far, as far as two NPCs are concerned. So I'm going to check it out like I said I would do last time. I was mildly curious. So I'm going to do that. But, you know, uh, from then on, it's pretty much open to whatever happens. Like if I'm being captured and, you know, dragged into a basement where I have to, you know, call for help and stuff like that. I don't know. Uh, I'm going to somebody else's house, which, you know, he's known for doing something nasty, but, um, and if all else fell, like, if I have a chance to either fall back from it, or if there's nothing happening at all, uh, what I'm gonna do is, uh, I am going to, yeah, over here, Ivarsted, Ivarsted, Ivarstar, like, whatever, um, I'm going there, uh, obviously to do what it says here, uh, speak to the Greybeards, that's part of the main quest. I haven't done that yet, although there's like a voice in my head that told me to do that, I think. Uh, I've been chosen! Just creepy stuff. And, um, I also, and this is long term, uh, I also want to go back to uh, Whiterun, because I've been noticing, I, I, I took a little um, look into my journal, and see, I got a, a few quests that gets me back to Whiterun. And for, in, in, for example, this one seems, yeah, that's the event, like the, the Wedding Ring thing, like last time I picked up, just by following a tree marker on my compass. That was really weird, but um, like I'm gonna do that at least. Like I have the ring, even though it's not necessarily in order. Like, I'm as confused as my character is from that, you know, happy hour of uh, drinking competition. So, and I think there's a couple of... Yeah, I think this one is also in run. Yep. So, um, long term is I have to gravitate um, towards Whiterun and finish some of the business there. And uh, Whiterun is also the place where Janessa uh, got picked up by yours truly. So, um, what's happening with Janissa? Uh, I've been thinking about it for a while. As much as I love NPCs, there might, I might let her go. Uh, yeah, I'm not exactly sure. Like, it's not something, oh yeah, I'll definitely let her go. I'm thinking maybe I'll let her go. And the reason, and I might as well just, well, not dump her, but might as well just leave her back to where I picked her up. The, the, the reasoning behind it is, um, as I'm doing dun some dungeon crawling with her, she's awesome in combat. Uh, all, it's almost scary as how far superior that she is to me uh, in terms of combat. But the thing is, like, she's kind of cramping my style as far as stealth is concerned. So, yeah, because she, sometimes she just runs in combat. Like, uh, a couple of times, where was I? I think... It wasn't too far from here. There was a, a... No. Maybe it was here? I think it was the... F it was a fort. Yeah, right before the, I got to the mill. There was a bunch of like cultists and stuff like that, right? Or mages, apprentices and stuff. And um, I was stealthing behind like some trees, you know, and I was trying to shoot a guy. And just because he got alerted by my presence, he didn't know where I was. Janessa just kind of charged in. Um, did not like that. Uh, so, yeah, th that's a thought 
Um, I'm probably not going to get end up in white run for another like two or three sessions, so that's not for another good a long while. So I have time to think about it, but I, that's been on my mind um, not since th this incident. I think it was. Uh, I think it was starting from the Felglow Keep actually, uh, where she, I tried to get her to navigate through traps and stuff like that. It was kind of awkward, and it was also that time. I think it was here. I think, yeah, uh, where I couldn't find her. Of course, I told her to stay put. Although I was pretty convinced that I told her to follow. But anyways, like I had some issues with the NPCs. It's not a bad thing design-wise, but I think like it doesn't necessarily match the style of my character. So she's a loner type of thing. So who knows? Um, so without further ado, um, because I'm just staring at a map for a while. Uh, I just wanted to get a, that out of the way, and now I'm just gonna go find. I'm just straight ahead. That's gonna be cool. All right, so let's go. Of course, it's freezing outside, and I'm wearing a T-shirt. That's always nice. Straight ahead, huh? Hey, pigtails. So I'm looking for a door in this direction. Is, am I being followed? I'm being followed. Oh, yeah. Obviously. <laughs> I thought it was a guard or something. Well, technically she is guarding me. Um, there it was. So, yeah, I'm following this lady. I don't know why. I'm trying to find my way. Actually, I'm probably not even... What? Okay. Um, I don't have a sense of scale when I'm reading these maps, do I? So it's here. Hey. I'd be out there fighting the Imperials right now if it wasn't for my war wound. Yeah, in the chest. Yeah. Be on the lookout. The butcher could be around any corner. The butcher. I already made that joke. But um. Okay. Let's see. Heard they're reforming the Dawn God. Vampire hunters. Yeah, you should go there. Might consider joining up myself. Yeah. Is this it? I'm confused. Aha! Ooh, it's alright. It's only a novice, so that shouldn't be too much of a problem. Oh. Sweet mother, sweet mother, send your child unto me, for the sins of the unworthy must be baptized in blood and fear. What? Sweet mother, sweet mother, send your child unto me, for the sins of the unworthy must be baptized in blood and fear. Why? Why? Oh, you old crone! You'll get what you deserve. The Dark Brotherhood will see to that. That's nasty. Please, how long must I do this? I keep praying, Night Mother. Why won't you answer me? Sweet mother, sweet That's mother. That's messed up. Me for the sins and why am I getting closer? That's just... in blood and fear. Sweet mother, sweet mother, send your child unto me for the sins of. Okay. He's praying to the night mother, which is wrong, uh, as far as I'm concerned, anyways. And I just made one plus one together, like I just edited it up. The kid was going to play with, because I I heard a conversation, I heard about this guy from a conversation with a kid and a an adult, an adult right? He was going to play with. Some dude, she told him not to. Why didn't I make the link that it was going to be a child? I do not know. Uh, here it is. I was actually I thought maybe the kids was trapped. When I first heard the kids' voice, I thought, oh god, that Latino guy. I'm gonna call him Latino. Um, 
I even don't even know his name. Like I, I should have tried to pronounce it at least once. But uh, yeah, I thought maybe he was captivating. Like he was get, like, he caught a kid somewhere or something. But no, it's he's just a kid doing creepy stuff. So yeah, I'm creeped out. If all comes to worse, am I supposed to kill it? Unworthy must be baptized in blood and fear. All right, let's try to be nice to him. Die, Grawad, die! Grawad, you old crone, you'll get what you deserve. Hey, what the hell, you man? Last. I knew you would. Are you all right in there? It worked. I knew you'd come. I just knew it. What? I did the black sacrament over and over with the body and the things, and then you came, an assassin from the Dark Brotherhood. <laughs> Okay, the first question is kind of. Well, I'm not who you. I thought it was like, who do you think I am? I was like, but that's kind of obvious. He already told me. Um. I know Janissa wouldn't mind. I don't know if I should remain silent. Actually, you know what? Yeah, I am going to remain silent. I'm going to hear what messed up kid has to say. You don't have to say anything. There's no need. You're here, so I know you'll accept my contract. What? What contract? My mother, she... she died. I... I'm all alone now. So they sent me to that terrible orphanage in Riften. Honor Hall! The headmistress is an evil, cruel woman. They call her Grella the Kind. But she's not kind. She's terrible to all of us. So I ran away and came home and performed the Black Sacrament. Now you're here and you could kill Grawad the Kind. Is it too late to come? Sorry. No. To be honest, I'm kind of lonely here. As much as I hated getting sent to Honor Hall, I really miss my friends there. I, hear, I sure hope that's not your mother. Oh god. An orphanage, eh? Well, to motivate a kid to go this far, he's either completely messed up. Well, no, he is completely messed up. But, you know, he probably has a good reason. Oh man, I should talk to a guard about that. Yeah, you're giving me the silent treatment too? Yeah. Riften, though, eh? That's kinda in my direction, I think. Cause yeah, I'm going, uh, I'm going south, and Riften is um, yeah, there it is. That's a pretty far away. Why? Well, I guess like if I go south and if I live like that, this path is like has bears all over the place, so. Uh, how am I doing in gear? Let's see, I bought a few potions already. I bought some equipment, I'm about half-ish in weight capacity, so... I think that's good. Alright. See, I always enjoyed playing like the evil assassin type. Uh, I always enjoyed even more just playing the helpful thief. Uh, see, yeah, that's a Dark Brotherhood kind of guy, right? I'm kind of torn now because I, like, I kind of want to help the kid. I should have talked to a guard. Like, give, give me a second, guard. He had a crazy, messed up kid in uh, his old room. He's got what like is it? remains. Dragons. No, it's a messed up kid. Fancy the leather armor, huh? Something to be said for going light. Yeah, it's quite ironic, right? Because light allows me to stay in the shadows. Didn't think of that. Alright, so I am going to travel. Obviously. 
The Imperators think us all lawless beasts. I'm proof of the uh -huh. And uh, what I have in mind is maybe try to get a ride in the well, not in the horse, but in the carriage. So. The best way for us to win the Nord's respect is through hard work. Yeah. Need a ride? Yeah, I'm thinking about it. I can take you to any of the hold capitals. <clears throat> oh, that's interesting. Okay, I'd like to ride in your carriage. Where do you want to go? Uh, I could go straight to Riften, actually. <clears throat> I don't know. Actually, that's not a bad idea. Go to Riften. You know what? No, I'm just gonna travel by foot. I like it. See Thanks, ya. man. I'm not afraid of bears. Much. Just gonna... Because... It's not a bad idea to just cut my travel. It's still a long way, right? And I'm thinking, oh no, the carriages are only from main towns, aren't they? Okay, and that's not considered. I, mean, like, I figured I could always walk here and then use the magical ride, but no, all right, I'm gonna explore anyways. I like it. Would have been a good plan though. Uh, wait. Wrong way. This is starting to be a good thing. I got a good feeling about this trip. Not that I mind too much about the whole carriage usage like uh, I already use it a couple of times and I, I I would assume some people associate it with like a magical teleportation kind of like the old um, travel system in uh, I was gonna say oblivion and there's also like it still works in Skyrim like you can just click on an area and teleport I think I use the term teleport but it's actually your you, it still counts your um, your traveling uh, whenever you're by foot Counts the time and stuff. It's very spooky. Are we being followed by an animal? Sure hope not. This should lead us not south. Actually, we're going east. I'm confused. Normally, I'm fairly good with the uh, sense of orientation, but Skyrim has proved me wrong on multiple times. Um, and this music is not. Hoping it's music in a way, because I'm thinking if it's sound that's slow, like ambient sound that's loading just in that area, it's gonna freak me out. It means like there's something, you know, very evil around. Hey, top. I'm up. I want to be on the right side. Well, if you're talking about the road, you're on the left side, idiot. Must be European. Damn it. Oh, 
Oh, don't kill the, the fox. Oh, I missed. Come here, you. Yeah, you saw my arrow, eh? Oh, that's a nice shot. Right in. Mm. Eh? That's one place a veterinarian would go. Oh, not there. Any place but there. I don't want the pelt. Just wanted my arrow back. That's sad. I couldn't save it. <laughs> 